All right, let, let's go to this play. Let's see exactly what happened. Let, let's see what transpires on this play. Okay, so Ladanian Tomlinson. What's Ladanian Tomlinson's catch rating? What's his, what's Ladanian Tomlinson's catch rating, bro? Let's figure it out real quick. All right, Tom Brady set up in the pocket. The dude is a goon. Okay, so now we go here. We throw the ball. What, what does he do here? The ball is thrown. Okay, so it's a drop. Oh, oh, okay. What, what is this mechanic called? Because he's just running. Look at how his position is. How is this a pick? Look, okay, look. Let, let's, just, let's just pause it right here. Let's just pause it right here. How is this an interception? Let's just, let's just all logically think about this. How is this an interception? Do you see Willie McGinnis' face? He's looking back like, yeah, EA Sports is at it again, bro. He don't even want to do it. He got that face on like, I'm just here so I don't get fined. He doesn't even, he, yo, he doesn't even want to be a part of this. How, with the way that he is right now, is this an interception? How? T yo, any, you would never, ever in your life, look at the way his body is, bro, the way that his angle of his body is, he would probably rupture his spleen if he turned around that quick to pick the ball. It doesn't matter, like, look, LaDainian Thompson dropping the ball, that's not the issue. Because LaDainian Thompson is garbage. But Willie McGinnis' position, how does this make any sense? So look, his body is turned that way. So how does he pick it? Okay. Look, look right here. All right, so he's right there. The ball's behind. Is the ball behind him? <laughs> Yo, <I'm just> <laughs> Yo. <laughs> wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Hold on, hold on. Is the ball behind him right now? Is The ball is behind him, right? Just, look, let's let's think about this. Hold on. <laughs> Yo, <I'm just> kidding. <laughs> Yo, yo, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, wait a minute, wait a minute, guys, can you intercept this, can you, you know what I'm saying, yo, the ball is behind his back, how, 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 how does he intercept this, this doesn't make any sense, it's, he's looking, he's not even looking at the ball, that's what I'm saying. He would have had to do something to make the ball become in front of him to pick it. How, how does he intercept this? Let's look. Oh! Wait, wait. <laughs> so hold on. The ball is behind his back. Yo, wait a minute. How does... Wait a minute. No, 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 no. He, it's no way... He can't turn around that quickly. Hold on. Wait a minute. What exactly happens? Um. Oh, so he's still looking the same way. But, but how does the ball... What? The ball is behind him. But then it ends up in front of him? How did... Hold... Is... Am I going crazy? Wait a minute. Is the, is the ball behind him? Or no? It looks like the ball's behind him. But he never... He never moves, but the ball moves. And ends up in front of him. How does... The way that it is... Doesn't it look like the ball is behind him? I, he has 102 awareness. Bro... Even if he has 102 awareness... Hold up. Th then the ball... I... I this, 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 this... It doesn't make any... I'm trying to figure out... Hmm. He drops it. Okay, that's fine. Everybody drops the ball in Madden 18. It doesn't matter his catching stats. He drops the ball. All right, cool. The ball's dropped, right, guys? Okay, so... Cause, you know, that's what all they do in EA Sports. They be like, yo, how can we figure out a new camp to make the guys drop the ball? So he drops the ball... The ball ends up behind this guy. It doesn't make any sense. Like, you see how EA makes him turn, but if the ball's velocity continues to take it where it's going, if we try to do it mathematically, and we look at the ratio of the flux capacitor, how does the ball that's behind him, because he never... I, what? Okay, all right, yeah, yo, listen, look, it, it doesn't, let, let, hold on, wait a minute, let's look at something else, though, because this man, um, third and seven, a 45-yard run, okay, Willie McGinnis, hold on, let me, let me see something, Tom Brady, Kellen Winslow, all right, so he throws the ball, okay, 
Let me see something right here. Because I think I got to get rid of Josh Norman too. Okay, so both of these guys... Josh Norman has a 90-something zone. And he's just running a dumb route. And Josh Norman, he's in an outside blue. Keep in mind, I've tried cover two. I've tried cloud, cloud flats. I've done everything. This guy, number 55, is that Brooks? Because I actually have Brooks in a flat. But because the tight end is on the outside, EA makes them play another zone. Brooks has a decent zone. So he just does... Yo, hold on, wait a minute. He does a simple... You know, he's just doing an out route. Why is Josh Norman going inside? Why are both of my guys... Look at my defenders. Two defenders. He's double teamed. Look at both my defenders. They're running into each other so that this guy can get wide open. I, I don't... I'm just trying to figure out exactly what EA Sports is doing. That's all I'm trying to do, guys. I don't, I don't fully understand what's going on. Um... But if you look at it again, I think this time I might have had him in cover two. And he's going to do the same thing again. It's going to be the same situation. Both of them are over there. Okay, but for some reason, he's in a flat. He's in a, this, my, my def, Brooks is in a flat, but he goes to the inside to follow that guy. Why, why does he do that? Yeah, this is cover two that he's in. He's in cover two, and he's still with 93 zone. Uh, Josh Norman, 93 zone corner. He still goes to the inside. Why? Why, why, does he, why does he go to the inside of the play? This is cover two now. So I showed you cover three. So this guy, Vic Beasley, he's actually supposed to be... What is he... I, I don't know what he's doing. He goes with that guy. Okay, so why is he going inside? Why does he ever go inside? If he's reading... If he, he plays the out. He's just playing. He's supposed to be playing the cloud flat. Everything outside. Why does he go inside? Yo, let's. <laughs> he's gonna usually delete the bad plays. EA don't care about that no more. EA is about that life, bro. So, what exactly is going on? Why does my corner not pay attention to the to his zone coverage that he's supposed to be covering? If his zone is to the outside, why is he breaking inside? That's a rhetorical question. There's really no reason to answer it. Josh Norman has since been fired. You guys know how it transpired. Pretty much, we called his wife or a significant other into the Gmai's World office in which she was in the need and he was terminated. Not only that, his homeboy Casey Hayward has also been found on the breadlines. I'm going to let you guys understand something. Although the game has been patched, dudes still run around doing whatever they want to do. It's up to you if you want to take a stand. Let's take a stand against bums and raid sell these clowns that come out and play no D. Even if they're in the proper zone, these guys refuse to play D. Which is why we get their wives or their significant other in the knee. It may seem disrespectful, but it is disrespectful. So it doesn't matter that it seems that way. I'm intentionally trying to destroy these men's lives, and they are on my team, so I choose to do whatever I want to do with them. As far as we go with our corners right now, we currently have the um, GOAT, Deion Sanders. He is a bum, but he's 90 overall, and he didn't really cost me much. And on the other side, we have Marshawn Lattimore, a rookie premier card that sucks as well, that's been getting dotted up as of late. But hey... Even if I had Barber, whoever you guys want to name, Eric Allen, whatever corner you think is good, he's really not though. And he's going to let you down when at least, but what, what, when you least expect it. So as we look at this guy and we're about to fade to black, we have to understand his wife was in the knee for a reason. I didn't do it intentionally. And I'm going to urge you right now as we head into the Christmas promo to continuously watch what your players are doing. Because I don't think they care and they don't take you seriously with the way that they've been playing. Especially on my field. And I just don't tolerate it. Here at Gmiles World, you come out here, more than likely when you screw me over, you're going to have your wife. In the knee! Make sure you understand that before you step on my field. Josh Norman had to learn the hard way. If you still have flashback Josh Norman on your team, please remove him from your lineup post-haste. The guy sucks. Casey Hayward, team of the week. He sucks as well. I want to thank you for joining me. If anybody can figure out what happened with that interception, leave it in the comments. Until next time.
One love.